Dead Space 2, we're on hardcore mode. We're on part 4, chapter 10, double A gamer for life. Alright, so, uh, getting to the later part of 10 here, and we're making our way out to the command deck, I think it's called. Entering zero gravity. So uh, we're going to make our way uh, to the bridge and after we uh, use the tethers to bring uh, the tram back online so Ellie and the other dude can get across, we're going to take an escape pod and crash into the area where we're heading and then uh, that's going to end 10. So, But as we make our way to the next area, we're going to have a couple of lurkers coming at me here. Okay, there's about, I don't know, three, four, five of them up in here, and I just found that it's a lot easier if I just float right over to the door here and wait for them to come to me. It puts them on the ground in front of me, and then I just blast them. Definitely take the time to loot as much as you can. Definitely looking forward to getting into the middle part of 11 so I can get my advanced suit. Hell yeah, three pack of health. I'll take that. Nevertheless, that's uh, 5,000 credit right there. Allison Lander, Brandon Larach. Thank you for 
for identifying Ishimura archive footage and rig logs that could potentially contradict the official storyline of its demise at Aegis 7. It is critical that no word of the artifact's recovery ever be surfaced to the public. It is disturbing that such records still exist this many years after the incident. We have research teams access and will be replacing them with EarthGov specialists effective immediately. Please contact me once the replacements arrive. That's it, you wanna get me. back to your little safe corner? I don't think so. Mines don't always work, but that's why you always see me switching back to the Air Force gun. If you get a kill, great. If not, just blast them with the Air Force gun. Like I was saying, it was a it was a good battle through ten. Eleven is the same way. It's multiple levels and shitload of enemies coming at you from all directions. And that's uh, the way this game rolls. I'm almost to the captain's nest to activate the tethers. All right. The centrifuge looks full to full power from here. Great. Let's hope this works. It'll be tight. You ready? All set. I'll wait for your signal. Tracks are moving. 
All right, so when we crash into the area that we're heading to, uh, I'll have a little quick uh, cutscene with Ellie and the uh, Strauss dude, and that's going to pretty much wrap up 10. Then we're off to 11. And uh, 11's a good uh, lengthy chapter as well, but eventually we're going to get to our van suit, and that's going to be a big plus. Uh, having the 25 inventory slots and whatever upgrades you get with it is a big, big help. Uh, having to spend 40,000 in credits definitely uh, kind of sucks. That would have been four power nodes, but uh, you're going to just have to bite the bullet on that one. The suit is way worth it. The later part of the game, you're going to need all those uh, inventory slots. Okay, we'll get a little uh, clip scene here with Ellie. It's gonna be okay. I promise. This won't be a bit. Not my heart and hope to die. Trust! Stick a needle in your eye. Trust! I do it! Alright, we'll see you on the next one.